Hello guys, True Nightmare here, and today we are playing Killer in Exiles, the first part of the series we're doing. This will be replacing Minecraft for Hardcore, um, because not many people of you are interested in Hardcore Minecraft, and um, I figured, you know, it was better to go to a game people were actually enjoying right now, and this is the one of the games. So apologies Piggy, I know you voted against this in the Discord, but uh, yeah, we're, we're playing Conan Exiles. I'm going to play from the beginning, uh, and we're going to play through. Hopefully get somewhere decent in the story. Uh, so yeah, this is going to be happening every week. And uh, we will be... We're doing our best to survive. We're going to be playing this every week. Build, survive you know, all that fancy stuff, and just see where we get to. Uh, later on I might get people to join me, but for now, it's just me. Alright, so we're going to choose a male character, because of that way I can hide the nudity and not have to worry about it. Uh, pretty easily, because it's just this. It doesn't really matter. Uh, quickly, quickly change this to... Uh, uh, none, I want no nudity, thank you. Uh, and let's get on with this. So race doesn't have anything to do with statistically. So I'm just going to use the most basic race, uh, ba the, the most basic one that I like, which was this guy, I think. Um, I think I will stick to my religion of healing because it's going to be probably the best one to stick with. Yeah, let's go healing. Cut me down, please. I'm basically doing all the ones that we had in um. In the first look, because I, I liked my character in the first look. Uh, let's go, no facial hair. And two, because I'm two. Let's go! Piracy. Okay. During the year of the Cobra, a prisoner captured by unknown means was transported into the exiled lands, crucified and left to die for crimes that they may or may not have committed. Death comes swiftly on black wings, until fate intervenes. Thirsty, dead man. Shall I cut you down from that corpse tree? It might kill you. You civilized men are soft. Your lives are not nailed to your spines. Where I come from, we kill our enemies in battle. We don't leave them in the desert to die like dogs. So, you live again, dead man. This land does not love men. You are marked. The ghost fence wearing that. <laughs> it might have been kinder to leave you on the cross. Live, love, burn with life. 
slay and survive. We will meet again, dead man. Uh, sorry about that. So you guys would have already seen that if you had watched the first look and all the stream that we did. Um, because we did actually play through that again on the stream. Um, but yeah, so when it comes to recording, I can record this game at ultra settings. But when it actually comes to streaming, it's just a, it's just a no. It won't let us, which is kind of annoying. Um, but hey, at least I can play it where, you know, like this. A 720p ultra settings. Haunted one, the very boundaries of civilization. Beyond the passage of our highways, by the wild places of the world, where untamed savages make endless war upon each other. You cannot pass into the endless wastes enslaved. Your bonding prevents it. Return. Follow the road. Any road. All roads lead to the city. All right, cool. So uh, we're starting this again. Oh, I am beaten, left to rot among the ruins of the past. There are others here, slaves, bandits, and cannibals, exiles from lands I've never heard of. Some of them try to scrape a life from the wasteland, scrabbling the rocks and sand from their own place. I cannot go on. The life that I left behind haunts me. The sun of the glittering spires of Belverus is forever denied me. The smell of my daughter's hair. I will pass the ghost fence. And this cursed land will finally end me. To whoever reads this note, I leave the last of my water and this message. Stranger, you have my pity. You do not know how cursed you truly are. Oh, did he leave his water here? Oh, he did! Oh, that's... Okay. That's cool. So I didn't explore this area first time. Because I didn't think much of it. Uh, but then, uh, when I was playing for it again, I noticed that you could pick up stuff. And I was like, oh, okay. Might want to check this place out before we go uh, running off into the main area of the game. Which, uh, you know, might be quite useful. Didn't even notice that note there the second time either. So that's, uh, that's a first for me. Which is pretty useful. I don't know if I can craft yet. I think I need sticks, which I'll get later, later on. Um, I did completely ignore the bone statue things. Sad where there's a world where this has to come. Uh, can I craft uh, clothing yet? I can. I can also craft a water skin, which I have one. I have a water skin. Uh, I can't do weapons yet. Yeah, there we go. I'm making clothes myself. This is going well already. Alright, some branches. Uh, and what do I have more of? Do I have more wood or do I have more... Okay, trousers are done as well. Uh, I think I've got more stone. Okay, I've got more stone. So let's get uh, an axe. 
And then we'll go down to some trees, get some pickaxes. Oh, what's this? There's almost nothing there. Craft the tool. Okay, I can now craft a stone hat. So yeah, we're trying to build, survive, do all that sort of good stuff here. Um, I know I know someone wants to buy the game and join me, which I would be happy to, you know, do. I'm more than happy to play with more people. Uh, but I don't want to do online, like I don't want to have like a massive server because I don't want to lose my stuff. And as I'll only be recording like once a week, I don't really want to be, uh, be in a state where I go back to the server and then I've lost all my stuff because I've been gone for a week. Hello. Give me your armor. Gods cursed this sandstorm. We were forced to take refuge before the wind scoured the skin from our faces. There is something in the storm. Beasts. We hear the skittering of their paws outside the ruins, and their howls mingled with the screaming winds. The men are scared. I've put them to work crafting rudimentary weapons and torches from the loose stones and rough plants that dot this place. I've yet to meet a beast that like fire, or the bite of the axe. Alright, let's see if I can craft anything else right now, because I want... Yep, I want that. And I want that. I want that. That's all I can make right now. But yeah, that's roughly what I wanted, because then I can uh, start building buildings and whatnot. Uh, stone, twine, branches. See, branches are the hardest thing to get in this game because uh, I can easily get stone. Like 50 stone just there. But branches, even if I cut down trees. It's hard to even get them. Um, generally, you just have to find them. It's like I can't even uh, cut down like trees to become logs of any kind. That one dropped down. Okay, we are nearly at the desert. birds. Be really cool to have actually have some bird meat. Okay, so we're here now, which means twigs and shit should be coming pretty early on. Okay, I think I craft the sword now, which is what I want. Oh, five twine. Be cool if you could, um. If you could craft this and automatically craft the stuff as long as you have it. That would be a nice little feature. Then again, when it comes to games like this, there tends to be like 17 different ways of crafting the same item. So. Yeah. Okay. Um. I guess we'll just start our home off where we where we did last time. Unless we can find somewhere better. I know I want these eggs down here. That is a That is a must have. Did I get the shield? I did not. I'm too level level to actually get it now, right now anyway. Uh, I'm pretty close to leveling up. Leveling up. Let's level up. Good thing. 
Let's get a uh, stone foundation. The fact you can just get so stone so quickly just makes me so happy. Um, Megan's recently got back an arc, and it's just like I could I couldn't do a arc. It's just everything happens so slowly, whereas in this one, you can just get through it really easy. And this isn't without any mods, uh, modifiers or anything like that. It's just complete, just the base game. It's just so much quicker. Okay, that's just stone. Hello there. Oh, hello. I didn't realize you were around. I'm sorry. Oh no, there's a human involved. Better get out of the way of the human. I don't really want to fight more than I have to. Oh, he's, a f he's fighting with me. Okay, wait for my energy to recover. Okay. I don't think he's gonna come up here, but I'll just wait up here anyway. One of them's gonna die. I leveled up. Nice. Let's get the uh, shield one down. Ah, oh, I cried more wooden twine. Oh, the human died. Okay. Uh, well, I didn't want us to upset him in the first place, which is quite useful, I guess. Ah, oh, he's down there. Okay. Let's see what gear he had. And uh, we'll go from there. A little bit of damage from that fall. Oh yeah. Um, take all. Uh, let's, let's let's kill him. Let's let's, let's chop him up. Human hide. It's, it's not the best of ideas. Um, we don't get any meat from him, do we? Good. Don't want. I don't want to be eating uh, strange meat. But he did give us enough to build a shield. Should we have to deal with you again? Yep, okay, five and then eight. How do I defend? Control. There's nothing on him. I'm sorry, I didn't even want to kill you. Alright. Cool. Let's get the... This combat is actually really intuitive, once you figure it out. 
I mean, I, I do get that to be a while first time. Fight. I just give me a handful of insects, doesn't even bother me to fight. Patch. Okay. Oh, branch is here. Uh, how much do I need for a bonfire? Five. Let's go for it. And foundations will craft... I want three more in total, more or less. I'm going to have a 9x9 nine nine house to start off at. Just repair my axe. Use a bed or bed roll. Eat a um, fill of filling, fulfilling meal. Find a shelter. Yeah. So this drag this here for now. Six plus you. Um, we got meat. Haven't we? We've got a sandwich or meat. And we got a bit of wood left. Okay. So set the fire. That's backwards, but it works. Okay, and then we can eat this steak. Uh, I remember there was a way to emote, was it? Relax. Take it easy. There ain't nothing I don't need. There we go. I know you guys are up there. I played single player on my own a little bit and I went up there. There's some guys up there. Which is an issue. Okay. I have no idea how long it takes the night to come down. Though we are already 23 minutes into this. Alright, so we've got seven right now, we need two more. There you go. Um, I kind of want to climb the bridge just so I can see where else we should go. Because uh, the thing about this game is obviously you don't get given a direct anything. Pull these out in case anyone comes along, because I'm going to take these eggs. And every time I've gone to take these eggs, uh, someone has come along to like ruin my day. Bones and hide. I don't know if the bones are any useful, but uh, I know the hide's going to be good. Uh, did I? I didn't. Okay. Um, we are quite heavy. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go this way a bit. Because I haven't explored this way. I explored this way and there was crocodiles and I didn't really like that. We're going to go this way a bit. We're going to find a nice place to settle down. Start building our house. Uh, how much stone do I have on me? A decent amount. Let's get... Um, so I've got nine blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then I want walls for each of the sides. Three by three by three and then two. Because there's going to be a doorway. So 3x3x3 three by three by th uh, three by three by three is 12, 14, I want 14 wall blocks. Uh, I can only make one. <laughs> um, and a doorway, 
is the same. Okay. Oh, they're all the same. Okay, so I'll get two windows, a doorway, and yeah, the door is separate. We need to. We need to. We we need more wood for the door. Um. All right. We definitely want some water because that is going to help us the long run of everything. Okay. Having that water skin at the beginning is very useful. Um, there's going to be creatures. That sounds like an alligator. I cannot see said alligator. There's a big creature over there. I don't really want to go over there. Oh, hello. It's you. We're friends, right? Okay, cool. Yep, stay away. Good, good. Let's uh, travel the beach a little. Now that is an alligator. <laughs> I mean, I feel like something good's going to be up here, but I also might be wrong as well. So we're going to be very cautious. Because obviously being near the lake is something I want to... Oh, bunny! I'm only killing you because I want you. There's no um, animals in this. There's no pets in this game. Otherwise I probably would have tried to tame you as a pet. Alright. Um, I mean, this doesn't look like a bad area. I'll come back here next week and turns out this is where the dinosaurs live. There's no there's no dinosaurs in this game. This is just where they live. And this is like they get to destroy everything. Regardless of where you uh where you come from. Yeah, this looks like a good area. Uh, is that a cave? Ah, oh, a cave would have been perfect to stay in. But uh No. Okay. Uh so let's place foundations. I don't know what we can do with this human skull other than probably uh, put it down. Uh take my dead enemy. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't. I didn't kill the enemy, which is kind of more reassuring. But uh, at least, at least, I mean, it worked. That's all I care about. Um, okay, let's place foundation. Foundation. I can't place foundation there. Foundation. It's really hard to see my foundations. It's all in the grass. Um, but I don't think I can do anything about that. Unless there's a way to kill off the grass. If there's a visual mod to remove the grass, I would happily install that. I also keep forgetting you don't actually need to, um... Click. You can just hold it, which is very useful. We'll get the house built, and that'll be the end of the episode. Because I know what I want. And crop falls. Oh, hello. Don't mind me, just building my house here. Um. Seven outer face. That's right, good. Okay, I get the outer face and inner face confused. The outer face, it, it's showing you which side you have um, available to you. That's what it does. It doesn't, like from which, whichever angle you're at. So, where it says outer face here, that's what you want to see here. 
you don't want to see the inner face here because we're on the outer side of it. Outer face. Outer face. Outer face. Yeah, there we go. Because all the wood stuff, all the wood stuff, simply on the inside. That's more or less what I'm trying to get at. Um, and then I want more of them, which I think is stone. I'm on stone, yeah. So let's get some stone. We'll definitely get stairs and stuff later, but for now, a single story place will be fine. Um, and then uh, eventually, I want to make a kingdom, so that'd be cool. I made five, I don't think I want five. Oh, actually I do want five, that's good. That's good. Um, to facing. Okay, out of facing. Out of facing. And then we want two windows. Which requires more stone. That's fine. It's okay. I'm not here to hurt you anymore, guys. I mean, you'll probably definitely go on my plate sometime later, but uh, for now, you're fine. I made a doorway. Oh, I got a secondary in case I need it. Yeah. Window. Cool. We need roofs. And, uh, yeah, I need a door. Which I think is more wood. Ah, five twine. And how do I make the roof pieces? Ceiling. Uh, I need more wood. So I need nine of these, which means I need more stone and more wood. That's fine. That's fine, it's not too much. See, look how easy this is to get all this stuff. Okay, that should be more than enough stone. Let's cut down this tree. And I think that's going to be enough wood, actually. This is what I d didn't like in Ark. Like, it was just too hard in Ark. Is it more wood or stone? Stone. We need 21 times 9. Hundred and eighty-nine. I didn't even didn't even realize this was big enough to be broken. I am running heavy on the uh, weight side of things. Ah, oh, no, my pick. We're definitely gonna have to make some chests and storage containers. Should be enough to make nine. There we go. All right, set back. I'll let you can craft and move. I 
I like that I can actually uh, play stuff whilst, you know, moving. That's good. Okay. And home wouldn't be home without some sort of bed. Uh, free fetch. Twenty. I only have two. Here we go. We are nearly done. <laughs> All right, so we got ourselves a bed, which means we will now respawn here. Yeah, let's let's sleep. Sleep on this bed. Alright, thank you guys for watching, if you enjoyed make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and if you're interested in seeing more of these, uh, the like, likes are definitely helpful, and it definitely helps me to see that you guys want more of these, and uh, yeah, hopefully we'll get more people on this, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!